To all of you coming to London for the London Marathon, let me let you know the weather's lovely, London is ready, the city awaits your arrival. This will be the walk for most of the runners leading up to the start line. The nerves will be pumping, they'll have done all the miles, funds raised for charity. And unlike my previous video, I can release where the race will be run. This is Blackheath Common. The park was Greenwich Park that you'll be walking through to your start line. The race is ready. This is Babas, <laughs> my official mascot for the London Marathon. Get used to it because you're going to be seeing him in all my London Marathon videos. Rhinos are on extinction. And this is bananas, spinach, and raspberries. Rabbit food. All right, what I wanna do in this video is go through some of the comments I got from the previous video I made about um, where the athletes train in London and why I won't reveal their location. Glad to see that most of my subscribers or most of my viewers uh, agreed that I should not disclose where the location is. So I know that many more will watch. Um, the few that decided to comment, I'm gonna big up your channels. So, first uh, shout out goes to Go Kiwi, who's a new subscriber of mine, I think, for the past year or so. And he makes uh, running videos way down in Australia, if I'm not mistaken. And he says, yeah, don't tell them, don't tell where they train. Your coverage is way to go. Keep up the good work. More videos, please. More videos are coming. <laughs> More videos are coming. I'm not going to tell you who I filmed this morning. Mucusless Fitness. Mucusless Fitness does lovely um, analysis videos on uh, running techniques. I agree with everything he says. Check out his channel. Mucusless Fitness says, thanks for the footage. Keep the location a secret. But as you said before, runners are not popular. So do not expect a lot of people to cover their training like you do. If Mo shows up to this park, that would definitely change. Who else agrees? I agree. It will be nice, but it's nice to keep the location a secret as well. Limonex. Thanks for the video. From a different perspective, though, running a marathon requires a special discipline. These athletes and a pleasing as popularity is, and as pleasing as popularity is, need their peace they need a spot of high tranquility to train so perhaps it is better you have not publicized the place ah and this guy uh trinitrophony nitramine I, I need to find out what that is I, I always say i'm gonna find out what that is and he uh, he made a different comment he says um i think this was in regards to why I said they jog in the last week leading up to the race compared to doing split workout. He says they are trying to build that glucose storage before the race. A light jog would do the trick. A jog to them is a run to most of us. Agree. Tima Sultan. Come on my brother. I expected your video. Tima Sultan, yes. Thank you. I made sure I took leave for this leading up to 
the London Marathon. I wouldn't miss it for the world. Daniel Janiki, looking forward to watching the videos of Kichogi and co training. Don't listen to the negative comments. Keep following these videos. We understand that you respect the athletes. Any predictions for Sunday? I can't see past Kipchoge. I reckon he will run sub 203. Daniel, I tell you what, I will do separate predictions for each of the athletes I will pick. Uh, in no particular order to review and give them give you my predictions on Kipchoge, Kipton, Farah. Wilson keeps saying and I'll have a look at who else is on there and give you my predictions on those all separate videos And then I got Yinka in Brazil Yinka no offense But if you really love the sport and want to keep the athletes and want the athletes and Want to help the athletes keep their privacy before the race then don't make videos like this Or at least not one with such clickbait title also, you would have to be clueless to live in London and not know the park you are filming. It is obvious from all the surrounding structures you are showing. Respect. Oh, Baboon Mano replied to Yinka in Brazil. He asks their permission as I've been watching for years. And the title is rhetoric. You are obviously lost in translation, son. Go be negative elsewhere. <laughs> Jan Daniel Janiki, thanks, come to my defense. He says, usually when someone starts a sentence with no offense, their actual intention is to provide offense. Well, I'm not offended by any of your comments, Yinka. So what YouTube is about, eh? Thank you. I will keep filming and um, coming up after this video is a video I made this morning. So for me and Babas, we'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Mm -mm. Come on, my brother.